So it's finally time to start off with our demo application, our real world example, which we call Exchangeogram. So to get this started, let's create a new Xcode project. And for the first time, let's use not the single view application, let's use the master detail application instead. And this template is awesome. So let's, uh, let's name our uh, project Exchangeogram and hit next and create and there it is and now let me just resize this window and let's have a look at the storyboard and the storyboard shows something that you might have never seen before which is called a split view controller and i need to hide everything on this huge display to show you everything that we are going to, uh, to work with. And let me uh, decrease the size. So let's go to 50%. So what we have here is a so-called split view controller. And it splits itself in two navigation controllers. Each of them um, has a different uh, subset of view controllers. The first one has a table view controller as as first part of this navigation controller and the second one has just a simple um, UI view controller as a uh, sub view controller here. And if I run this application, you're going to see that this is really, really amazing what this can do for us. So when we have a look at it, we are on an iPhone 6 and I add some, some data to it. All right. So now I have, uh, I have added that data and I, I switch to landscape and you see there is still, um, I, I see this in an in a ordinary table view. I click it and I come to a detail view controller. I get back to master. All right. I turn it again and as you can see, I click it and I get to this detail view controller. Now, all right. This is, of course, automatically when I click on this on this item, I get automatically to the detail because we have a segue here that brings me directly from the, from the table view cell to the uh, specific detail view controller. Now, if we now have a look at it and see it in the iPad Air, for example, let's do that. Then you can see that we get a to totally different experience. So we start with the master view with the detail view controller. And if I press master, you see we have such a pop over experience like we have with with the mail application. And if I swipe to the left and to the right, then you can see that the master view controller just pops up and I can add these um, these items here and click on it. And they change in the background, as you can see here when we have a look at this number. Uh, when I click on them, you can see they just change. And so this happens in uh, in portraits. So if I switch to landscape, then you can see that I get also like with the mail application of Apple, we get the same great experience. Uh, we can delete that stuff and so on. This is an ordinary table view controller. Now let's have a look at the iPhone 6 Plus where we get another really, really cool effect when we run this application in the 6 Plus Simulator. Um, so let me uh, make this a little smaller. We start in the Master View Controller and I can add some of the items here. And if I rotate the device, then you can see I get this uh, this great master detail experience, you know, from the mail application. If I press this magnification button, you see that I get rid of the master view controller and can only display the complete detail view controller. And we get this without writing a single line of code. And we are going to use this template in the next videos to create our exchange gram app. And um, as you can see, a lot of work was already done by us from Apple with this template. So let's get started.